I drive by this plaza once a week, once every two weeks or something like that. Every time I drive by, I'm amazed. This property is so huge and it's just abandoned. And for some, for some reason, it's not for sale. And I think this could be a great opportunity for a commercial real estate investor. This is an A-plus suburb. Uh, locations great, close to highway nearby a lot of businesses a lot of houses that are a little bit more expensive than average in chicago suburbs so let's pull up a little closer what do we got we've got huge huge plaza that's just vacant completely vacant plaza Right here, it's all vacant. Let, let, let me drive by a little bit. Let me drive by a little bit. I remember one time I brought a client here. Um, there was a spot, I think right there, um, for flowers. She was, she was interested in having like a flower spot, but this was a little bit busier than it is right now when we were looking at it. Like I think, like see the potholes here, that needs to be fixed. Man, I'm so, I'm so, it's so interesting. When can this be sold or bought? I'm interested in, you know, in, in being in this deal in some way, shape or form. Because I know this beautiful location. Location is amazing. Man, location is amazing. But look, this is, this is wow. Look at this. Just, somebody had to come in and put these boards up. Somebody had to come in and put these, you know, plywood. It's not that it's just left. Somebody put the plywood on. Like for what? What's the reason? Somebody not to break in and steal something? How is that gonna help? See, it used to be like a table tennis. Sports, gym, camera equipment. At one point, this probably was a very busy plaza. Take a look from this angle. Like that. At one point, I think this used to be a, a busy plaza because, you know, it was all filled up. The signs are still here. There's a dentist, bowling dance, hair salon. Arts, acupuncture. Man. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta figure out what's happening with this plaza. So I just called the number here on the sign, and uh, she said that she is interested in selling it, but she didn't want to talk numbers right now. She said, "Call me in a couple days. I'm busy right now. This and that." She said, "This this property is not a piece of donuts. So you know, you gotta have the money." Because I said I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be interested in buying, but. I want, I want to partner up with somebody. This is a real opportunity in my opinion. This is huge, huge. Re I know that retail is not, you know, a super, um, you know, desired property type in 2024. But my opinion is this. Anything can make sense if the price is right. This is, there's a lot of small units. Those could be like internet proof type of businesses, you know, salons, massages, there's a bunch of businesses that internet can't replace. So I think it's possible to break it apart. It's huge. It's probably like 50 businesses can fit in here. So, and location is just 